Hello, this is Jack from tofluency.com and in this English lesson, we're going to talk about using the present perfect in the negative form and you're going to see how I use this and then you'll see some further examples. So let's look at the video now. It's raining, it hasn't rained for ages. So we're very grateful to get some rain. In the video, I said, it hasn't rained for ages. So you can see I'm using the present perfect here in the negative. Another way to say this is the last time it rained was a long time ago. But it's very common to use the present perfect here to talk about durations in the past until now. So we it hasn't rained for a long time. That's why I'm using the present perfect here. Here are some more examples to help you understand this. I haven't watched a movie for months. They haven't visited us for a long time. And the last one is a little bit different. He hasn't been to Thailand. Now, in this case, I'm not saying for a period of time, but when you say he hasn't been to Thailand, it means forever. He has never experienced this. He has never been there. So that last one is a little bit different. The first two are talking about durations that started in the past until the present.